Hey, this is Dr. Barbecue, and it's time to go on a barbecue journey with Dan the Man. Good morning, everybody, and good morning to Dan. How are you, Dan? I'm all right. How are you? I'm doing just fine. How was your weekend? I guess if you were grilling this weekend, that was a good weekend for you. It was good. I spent the majority of yesterday around three smokers, Yep. a charcoal grill, Yep. an outdoor deep fryer. My uncle has, yeah, I mean, he's on his way to opening up his own restaurants. What does he use the outdoor deep fryer for? Uh, or, or what did he use it for yesterday? Well, he didn't use it for anything yesterday. Yeah. But uh, the last time I was up there, he had a, a seafood boil yeah. that he used it for. Yep. And uh, he's go. I think this Thanksgiving he's going to try to deep fry a turkey. Yeah. So, but he he got it. Uh, I don't know a few months ago. I yeah. guess now. But well, uh, maybe you want to explain what this little uh, this little jewel is right here this... from the uh, from the barbecue bible. Yes, this is uh, sweet and sticky. Yeah. Uh, ribs, baby back ribs. Yeah. Uh, pr- pretty easy to make. I mean, most of his recipes are pretty simple. Mm-hmm. Once you take a big old bite of that, Chuck. Mm-hmm. I don't mm-hmm. know if I'm happy with that bite. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. They're What's good. the ingredients? Uh, you name it. No, I mean, I, obviously there's meat. Yeah. Well, it has, I think, mm. eight different spices mm-hmm. in there. And, uh... You, the the sauce that's on it mm-hmm. is basically pure sugar. Mm-hmm. You melt brown sugar or you melt uh, sugar in the raw mm-hmm. into barbecue sauce, molasses, honey, and syrup, mm. and melt that all down till it's smooth. Yeah. Yep. You must need gloves to take this off the grill by the time it's all slathered with that stuff. Yeah. With a some with kind of a spackle like. <laughs> It's good. You sure you don't want a second bite? I'm going to have it. I'm going to save it, though. Thanks. Why? Delicious. Yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. Yeah. I'm sure the girls are in on this, right? Uh, Leslie liked it. Tracy oh. does not eat before 6.30 in the no morning. No matter what it is. <laughs> no. No matter what it is. It's very good. It's very tasty. Yeah. yeah. you got to be happy with this. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah. It's uh, It turned out really well. I thought they were good. I adjusted the rub just slightly from uh, when I did Memphis Dry Rubs. Mm-hmm. Uh, because I thought that Memphis dry rubs were extremely salty. Mm-hmm. And so what I did was in the rub, it calls for half a cup mm-hmm. of salt. Mm-hmm. And uh, I cut that down to a quarter cup. And that Are seemed you, to make uh, a difference to me. Well, that's good. That's yeah. good. Congratulations, Ray. We like that. Mm-hmm. That's a nice summertime flavor for you. Oh, yeah. They, they were really good. Mm-hmm. Let me ask you something. Yeah. Are you the kind of guy who um, orders ribs at a restaurant? Uh, it depends. Not really. If if it's truly a barbecue place, I will. Yeah. But if they're ribs at like Chili's, mm-hmm. for example, right? No, no, I'm not getting those. But if if I go to, well, even uh, Brooks, I would probably order ribs. Yeah, or a community barbecue where there are smokers all going. Yeah. If yeah. if there are ribs available at a true barbecue thing, mm-hmm. then yeah, I'll I'll do ribs. I also really like pulled pork, and that's kind of. Pulled pork, I have found, is much more consistent in restaurants than I like pulled pork than ribs. If have we get, done? Have we done that yet? Have we done? Have, a have pulled you pork? done a pulled pork? There's no pulled or pork something? recipe. There's no pulled pork recipe. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. No. Nope. One would ask why, but well, I can I can probably find one. Yeah, but no. in, in the two books that I have from Doctor Barbecue, uh, I don't believe there's a pull. I haven't found it if there All is right. one. Well, that's good. Granted, man. there are hundreds of recipes, yeah. so that's very good. You folks will like this. I know this is a barbecue town, so go ahead and try it out. Dan will have up the uh, video, the recipe, the process. Easy process, probably. I mean, time consuming and outdoors, but yeah, well, you it's throw just, it on and you you brush it. Yeah, basically. Uh, at one point, you wrap it in foil, but it's. You know, it takes three and a half hours, mm-hmm. and uh, when you're done, you're done. That's good. That's, That's good, good stuff. stuff. I'm glad you took two bites of that. I was worried. No, that's fine. I like it. I'll have a third bite here in a little while, too. <laughs>